Hi, this is Kimmy here from Unique Scruffiness, and today I wanted to share with you some swaps that I have received. I recently hosted a postcard swap and an um, inchy swap on Artistic Creations. And Artistic Creations is a small uh, swap site um, based in New Zealand for Australian and New Zealand um, scrappers and swappers. So I'll leave an address in the description bar down below um, so that you could come and join if you like. Um, so here, here are the here are the postcards. These are um, it was a mixed media Mother's Day kind of theme, um, and the Mother's Day part of it was really quite open. So this is Paula's, and Paula is um, graphic scrap effects, and I'll leave a link to her blog and her YouTube channel down below as well. And Paula has used um, some holographic thread with some pearls onto a heart. And there's some stamping and some other techniques there that I'm not quite sure of, but um, I'll have to get Paula to show me how she did this. And she's stamped into some texture paste there as well. And a lovely piece of, um, of lace going down the side. I love these flowers. So Paula, you'll have to tell me what you did to get this effect on your flowers. So. And the next one I have is from Faith. Hey girly, Faith's um, done some texture stamping in the background so sorry about the glare ladies Let's see if we can get down here and then some stamping and some spraying with some lindies over the top of that and then on the back she's just giving it a quick spray with some lindies and on the that's the back of Paula's this one is from Jeanette and Jeanette is JD Studios and I'll leave a link to her down below as well and I might take this one out because actually Jeanette's has got a lot of texture on hers. Sorry about the noise. And you'll probably get to see it better without it being in the bag. But she's used, I don't know if the camera can focus on this. See, she's used some cheesecloth and texture paste and then some stamping. I love this part here. It looks like it was a doily. And then a nice big vintage image. So that was lovely, Jeanette. Thank you for that. And that's the back of her postcard. Next is from Sue. And Sue has chosen some lovely papers from, it looks like a lady's diary, but I can't be sure. And she's used some lace, some bling, and lots of ribbon. It's so pretty. And very feminine. I love it. It's nice and soft. And then there's mine which I have a video on, how I created mine. And then the last one I have is from Fiona. And Fiona does have a blog, but at the moment I haven't got address, her address. As soon as I do, I'll put a link to Fiona's blog in the description down below. Fiona has used some um, copper metal sheeting and she's cut that out with, um, with a die and then embossed it. And she has used some stamping. Um, let me see if I slide it out of the plastic sleeve. Yep, out of the plastic sleeve. There's some texture to her background. And then this is the back of hers. Thank you for participating, ladies. They are lovely postcards. Just gorgeous. I love them all. And our next, my next swap was to do some inchies. And the inchies... Were, it was a fairly open theme as long as there was some red, some black or some cream involved and you could use all three colours or you could use just one, it didn't really matter. Um, these are Paula's so, and I love how she's presented hers, I love the reusable tag. Um, and these are Fiona's and this is just super cute, I love this. She's designed a little matchbox and then when you open it up, all of them are in a mason jar. Can you see? Um, she's covered in plastic as well. <clears throat> a thin sheet of acet acetate over the top, which gives it a bit of a glare, sorry. But they're super cute. I love those, Fiona. Thank you. Um, the next one uh, is from Faith. And again, Faith has used um, some more glimmer mist and some. and made them grungy. Look at that. Look at wish the camera could pick up the shimmer that's there. Just gorgeous. And I love how she's put some crackle accents on her little owl. 
and is super cute. And each of us have our um, altered chipboard initial with a little bead and charm hanging off the bottom. A lot of work. Thanks for those, Faith. And then the last one, oh no, there's another one. Hang on. I've got to get it down. I've had this one hanging in my room. These are super cute. I love these. These are Sue's. I'm not sure if you can see them very well. It's got awfully bright in my room really quickly. So she's used the, a lot of the red and the black. A gorgeous little, such a tiny, tiny little butterfly. Look at that. How little is that? Just gorgeous. Thank you for those, Sue. And then these were the ones that I created. Um, I don't think that I can get them through. And I mainly used um, black and cream and wine. So they were my squats. Uh, the group is Artistic Creations and if you're from Australia and New Zealand and you'd like to join us, just come on over and follow the link down below and yeah, come in and say hi. We'd love to have you. Thanks everyone. Bye.